We're back. Hmm. Oh, I can unlock something. Let's see. Let's grab something there. Anybody new hiding anywhere? I don't think so. The person we just unlocked. You've already talked to. Yeah. Okay. Well, let's try that again. Leon. Leon usually wields a giant sword, but she is a master in all kinds of swordplay. Because her talents and skills are widely acknowledged, she also acts as an instructor for the investigation team. Leon can parry enemy attacks to protect allies and deal damage at the same time. Parrying enemy attacks is key to her playstyle, and she is suited for more experienced players. Hmm. Grand Reflex. Leon receives a parry buff every turn. When the target of Leon's countdown skill attacks a party member, Leon redirects the attack to herself and immediately casts her skill. Parrying reduces all incoming damage by 35% and protects healing gauge. Upon a successful parry, remove parry buff and gain one additional man next turn. Oh. If Leon did not parry for one turn, she receives 25% armor and healing gauge protection until the next received hit. Hmm. As a tank. Okay, well. Let's try that again. This time pay attention to the ways to go. Unless it was all a pre-planned thing. Hedgehog, what? Hello. The armed grass hedgehog seems to have something to say. Squeak, squeak, nice to meet you. I'm Sir Georgie, a traveler who is adventuring this world. Squeak. Squeak, I came here after hearing the news that mad people are dying. Squeak. Squeak, squeak, squeak. Do you happen to know anything about this, Squeak? I have no idea. Squeak, is that so? I see, Squeak. Squeak, squeak. By the way, I'm starting to get hungry. Could you spare me of some food? I'm asking you kindly, Squeak. Sure. Kindly spare a loaf of bread. Squeak, thank you for the meal, Squeak. Squeak, squeak. I hope we can cross paths again someday. I'll be on my way now, Squeak. Hmm. Okay. Because I don't really usually use the bread anyway. We got Two potions, or run a random potion, or use a key to get a potion and a relic pouch. Hey, I'll use my key. Guardian potion, okay. Get the basement, purifying, and a relic pouch. Cool. We got two at the end of a turn. No curses, or. Hmm, reduce damage. The no curse. Boss that way. See if it wraps around, is that? Hey, tellers are hidden? Probably not. Wraps around, okay. I don't have the key, if we get one. I try, I got a mage statue, right? Oh wow, it's all heals. Oh shoot. Yugi? Ah, oh, I could've exchanged a card.
in their wagon? Cool, red. These are red. Alright, um, increase mana. Ooh, arrows. Probably. Or pay for health for a key. Hmm. Nah, I'm already getting kind of low. Let's take knights, because it shouldn't get. It's an unknown, but it shouldn't get a curse. Wait. They have the. Oh no, it's not on yet, so I will get a curse. Okay. I gotta actually put it in. To the relic stand first. Ah, oh, Cerberus. Cool. Ooh, and dash. They're getting a lot of heals instead of attacks. Ooh. Working of Valor. Got a key. Okay. Can I go back? I think I can. Alright, so... Not sure. Same thing. Ooh. Fishing? Attack power plus. Oh, you start out of the battle. Okay. We'll get this. Oh, skeleton key. Receive five keys once or. Hmm. Y'all. Skills of all party members. It's like to learn. Ah. So if I keep it till the end, though. Receive five keys. Get the sports from him. Drum shot. Uh, wow. That's a lot. The skill's cost is reduced by two times the cost of the last skill played from hand. If the skill costs three or more, deal critical damage and apply this skill's debuff to all enemies. Ooh. So at least has to be three. Rapid shot, maybe, though? That's too rapid shot. I think I glossed over another one there, but we'll see when it see when it comes up again. Take our stone and key in. Can I take it out now? I can. No, nope. oh well. So I guess that's how that works. It just uses one slot and stays there. Okay. Oop, we want to recruit first, I think. 
Ooh, Elon Sharon Machine. Hmm. I'll become a shield for everyone. Maybe they're on. Really on. Then you use the herb to get bait up. And token of friendship. Fishing rod. Fishing rod. A sturdy fishing rod made from high quality carbon fibers. Anyone from beginners to experts can handle it without much trouble. Once you master it, you can use it to grab far away remote controllers or play with your cat. Hmm. Maybe? Perhaps. Let's see what happens. A gift? Where did you find something like this? For now, allow me to express my gratitude. Thank you. Just be thankful. Ah. Hey kid, how long do we need to go until it's time shade? Huh? What's wrong? Just tell me. You know where it is, right? As a girl of prophecy? Um, my powers only tell me the direction, so I don't really know about the distance. That's so. Silverstein, you seem a bit restless. Hmm. Are you scared? I can't completely deny that. Are you not afraid? Of what? Why do you think humanity took refuge in the Ark to escape from the Black Fog? You'd be considered lucky to survive in the Twisted Land for even a day. Anything could happen at any moment. But seeing you take the lead and light the way in front of us, I respect it. But I also feel worried at the same time. I don't know. More than being afraid, I understand this is something only I can do. If I run away, it'd be impossible for anyone to find the time shades. Are you okay with the fact that you could die trying? Maybe that could happen if I'm alone. But right now, I have a lot of trustworthy allies by my side, including you, Silverstein. So everything's going to be okay. A reckless kid. Relationship with Silverstein has improved. Cool. They're hiding somewhere and it's bothering me. Ah, I can level up people. Oh. Health augmenting patch. That's the skill on the target and the ally on their right side. Ah. Huh. Okay, so a double heal, huh? Health increase active until this stage ends. Maximum health plus 20%. Perhaps? Sure. Got a mana potion. Her, get her parry thing. The preparation, healing, gauge, protection. Whenever an enemy targets an ally, attack before the enemy and deal 12 damage to them. Remove one stack when activated. Useful. Remove random debuff from a selected ally and create a random attack skill on hand. The created skill gains the debuff that was removed. Ooh. Hmm. Reprisal. Pause it. Okay, so it does damage. Critical hit when cast by parry. Maybe that one. Okay. Try to keep formation. Enchantment table, which is safe. Hmm. Which is safe. Is the devil tent maybe? Right up. Oh, nice. It's a pain. What we got? Yeah, I don't have any soul stones to chuck in there. Here, let's get this over with. Cool. Parries. Let's see. 
me as a debuff yet. Gotta attack them. Yeah. Air attack power from them. I don't think it heals, so. Damage, that's a good thing. Double tap and do pain. Accelerate that. Boom. Get the buffer out of there. That. Scrolls, he absolves all curses. Nice. Um, armor plus, so. Ah. Ooh, cross brooch. Armor plus. Crit chance plus, or damage down, is resist plus though. Hmm. Essence ring, mix health, minus. Crit hit is plus and crit damage plus. Ah, just take it, take it. Then, I think, where was this? It wasn't down here, but there's another area to go. Ah, here we go. Um, capable of handling good power, Bladed Park. We just play through to prove your own strength. What? I did that already, though. Okay. Why do you want to Bloody Park? Unless you have to do so every time? Interesting. Ah, here. Nothing inside, but you can put something in. Putting in the soul stones, the vending machine made a loud squeaking noise and shut down. I can't really tell what changed. Interesting. We'll find out later, I guess. Ooh. Oh, healing. Good shot. Nice. Hit. Him. Nice. Get him out of here. Hmm. Fire. Cool. All right. Let's see. Crank up him. Reap shot blast. Yeah, that was another one. It was six additional damage to taunting targets. Special bullet. Seventeen additional attack targets. All enemies, but deals one less damage. Hmm. That's a lot of damage, though. Ricochet shot. Okay, 20 damage. Deals 20 damage to the enemy on the left or right side of the target. If this skill defeats the enemy, additional damage will critical hit. This skill will critical hit if facing one enemy. Hmm. Interesting. That's if... That's useful if one is taunting. 
I would ignore Stunt too. Sure. Shot. Cool. Okay, got some tablet. Identify an item. Identify that. Certainly faint when health reaches 0%. That's not good. What if I use this? Mapping scroll. Nice. Oh. There's a lot of stuff up there. I think that was the hidden area I just unlocked, too. I think that's what that thing is, isn't it? Maybe not. Hmm. Oh, anyway. Heck. That carpenter's doll. Ooh, it's pink. Hmm. I'll heal. Nice. All right, that. healing yet. I'll take 10. Cool. Jeez, a lot of unknown scrolls. Alright, so shop. A lot of keys, so I can just go through all these. There's a ring. Uh, I can see down. My tech power's up. Berserker ring. Super steam. Also, I can upgrade my mana. So let's identify some stuff. Okay. That. Transfer. Once of relic display stand in front of the boss tile. Cool. Hang into that. We got here. Convert items to gold or trial of bravery. I don't think it can really withstand much. But he fully heals afterwards, so... Hmm... I could combine those two... On fire... Or I could just sell them. Let's see. 300 gold. Ah. What else do we have to buy? Print. Start two skills from the deck. Praetorius is the user skill. Hmm. Ooh. Additional attack and counterattack damage is increased by three. Maybe. Do rush. 
Sprint. Elver Cylinder? Sure. Oh. Add to her. Rush to him. Up here. Two tabs, two herbs. Hmm, one key for a skill book, huh? Sure. Um, turn one. Turn one. Brow Roar. Precise skills in your hand gain 100% critical chance. Ooh, all allies gain 25% critical damage for the battle. Ooh, all enemies. Relentless swipe. That's reduction by one for this turn if an ally takes pain damage while the skill is in hand. Stunning time. You defeat an enemy with the skill, stun a random enemy. Hmm. That's also a countdown. That's a countdown. That's a immediate use. Let's, let's do that swipe. Book. Fire. Hmm. That. The. Was this? Nothing. Okay. Nothing to put on. Nothing to do. Have any upgrades to do? Okay, well, let's give it a go. The witch again. This time I'm actually kind of prepared. The curse to me, I'll endure the pain. Sure. Hey, that's an all enemy, so I'm gonna do that. A debuff from a select ally and create a random tech skill. Maybe? Uh, heals, heals, wipe attack. All debuffs. I could do that. Gain two mana. Move overload. Sure. Get rid of her. Get rid of him. Cool. Next. I have no attacks.
Ooh. Him. down to something else. I'm gonna heal her. Ouch. Fourteen. So nineteen. She's gonna go down. You see all pain. Ah. her debuffs. I should not take a jump shot because I can't use it yet. I don't want to lose her anyway. Sucks. Probably a hint, I guess. Shot. Nice. Get that. Bring her down. Surprise him. Uh, in turn, they're gonna summon more dolls, though, probably, right? Oh, there we go. Ooh! Which is tough. Especially when you don't have many attack skills. Alright, tablet. What's this? Bible revised. Hmm, healing power plus. Critical hit chance plus, we can egg actually plus. Nice. Go book key, soul stone. Hmm. Let's up him. Come another attack. Potion. Er. Bring it on and create two random attack skills of party members in hand. They gain exclude and deal half of the skill's original, skill's original damage. When an enemy attacks any ally, these skills are automatically cast on the attacker. Oh. Sure. Hmm. 